As wildfire season heats up, we continue our coverage of dry and dangerous conditions across Florida and in our area. There are 12 wildfires currently burning in north central Florida. Ten are contained. TV 20's David Jones shows us how Forest Service workers are fighting them. I'm by Hawthorne, down by Cross Creek, up by Rochelle. It's been a busy week for the Florida Forest Service. 70 active wildfires across the state, burning just under one and a half thousand acres. It's hot, nasty work. The heat buildup causes lightning strikes. Those, in turn, spark fires. Where those lightning strikes have hit the heavily wooded areas that are deep within the woods, it takes a while to actually access those fires. And then once you get there, there's a lot of available fuels to burn. Burn. The state is dried out, especially sections of north central Florida. Many of the wildfires in Wakasasa district are 100% contained, although they are still considered active. And another important thing to note, because of these just really dry conditions in our area, the Florida Forest Service is not permitting any outdoor burning in Alachua, Gilchrist, Levy, Marion, or Putnam counties as of right now. The only county governments to put out burn bans in our area are Bradford and Union. The Forest Service is recommending homeowners keep their yards and gutters clear. So the defensible space is, you know, the main thing. I mean, you want, you know, 30 foot, I believe it still is, off, you know, the home. You don't want anything that's combustible. We're going to continue to get lightning throughout the summer, but hopefully we'll get rain with it as well. So one less fire that a, a person causes is one less fire that we have to respond to. For tips and information from the Forest Service on how to keep your home safe, go to our website, wcjb.com. David Jones, TV20 News.